I've dropped a little monster. Just need to put my helmet on and we're good to go. I'll put this bag in my back, pack. And then what I'm going to take is for a little journey to my fishing pond that I'm a member of. I've not been there for a little bit. It's Christmas and whatnot. So this will be the first little intro video to the YouTube video. Hope you enjoy the journey on this uh, wintry UK day in Manchester. We're in Clayton at the minute, so I'm going to take you down to my local fishing pond. I'm on the Solar P1 Pro. Done a few modifications, not power-wise, but oh my God. but when it comes to making it look a little bit better, yeah, we've done that. I'm sorry for any wind, if there's any wind there, I'm sorry about that. Not really much I can do about that. Thank you. Look at that, we are now at Drollsden Park. Put my light on as well, so people know. Let's see go. Just got to be careful of police, obviously, but I don't think we'll bother as long as we're not beating an idiot on the road, you know what I mean? We're taking our time, weather's not that great, so we know traction's not going to be amazing. Give cars a bit of distance. So yeah, if you, if you stand here, man, you can't monster. I was a gamer. Well, still I'm a gamer. I just don't do it as much. And I thought I could name this. You can monster goes outside. Because I never went outside much, I did just some video games, so yeah, we're going to start going out, whether it's family outings to a park with the little ones and whatnot, fishing, going out on the scooter, yeah, we're just going to try and get out as much as possible, have some fun, because that's what it's all about, isn't it, so that's what we're going to do, please stay there, sir, thank you very much. I will show you the scooter when we get there, it's actually not that far away but this is the furthest I've been on my scooter so far so yeah it's a little bit nerve wracking for me but we get used to it and this thing has so much power, like I'm only in eco and second gear this thing has got so much more to give it is unreal but to be honest with you though I did just want a scooter where I could keep up with track if, traffic if I needed to, do you know what I mean? And, this has uh, allowed me to do so, so let's get across that real quick. Fucking eight roundabouts, just got a life out of me, but that wasn't too bad right there. First roundabout on the scooter. Indicators aren't on. I hope you can see everything in here, everything all right. Keep the at the moment. Still all right at the moment.
very rough a second, and we are now here, just there on the left. And it doesn't look like anybody's fishing here, so we could be all good. A nice smooth little journey there. We get the keys out so we can get on the pond, there's anyone here? Doesn't look like it. Bad little ride to be fair. No, nobody's fishing today. But yeah, I'll explain a little bit what this is in a second. Let me just close this gate up. And take my helmet off. Put that on there so it looks locked for now. Some of the lads might turn up yet, but yeah, this is my scooter, boys and girls. This is it. We've got the, I don't know how much of it you can see, but we've got the Solar P1. Nothing modification wise, like. Uh, like performance or anything but it's I've changed the cable things and made it a little bit nicer put some reflective tape on it I do want to do a little bit more to it I don't know what yet but we will do a little bit more to it somebody if any of you have got any places where we can get any modifications from in the UK make it a little bit I don't know maybe somewhere where I can get like these powder coated I want to change these for blue ones I would like to get this for a blue one as well if anyone knows where I can get them please let me know but that's the scooter, that's what we've been getting about on today. 50 miles an hour, 50 miles of range, three different gears, three different modes, parameter settings on it for days. Well, yeah, this is where I like to go fishing. Let me take this helmet off. I can't breathe properly. But yeah, and here's my, well, say new helmet. It was just one for now. I put a bit of reflective on the back. But yeah, it's not too bad. So it's looking all right. Normally there's like lilies and stuff all the way over there and all that stuff. Yeah, this is the first little ride out. We've only gone to like the the neighbouring place of where I live. We're only in Drosden. But yeah, let's go out for a little ride. Get a, a video for the YouTube, for the new channel. I hope you will enjoy it because I'll be enjoying going out having some fun. Like I say, it's not just scooter rides and stuff like that it's gonna be going out with the family on adventures when we go on holidays oh the rain's kicking in didn't say it was gonna rain but it's starting to rain as you can see weatherman lying to me again um but yeah we'll be going all over the place from to wales probably abroad places in the in the near future we're getting our passports sorted and i'm gonna have to probably <coughs> sorry about that <coughs> <coughs> probably gonna have to put the waterproof casing on this camera because I don't want it breaking I uh, ordered myself some new riding gloves as well let's go down on one of these pegs but look how blue that water looks I'm sure they put something in it I'm not too sure but yeah see the scooter light over there so yeah this is my local pond that I'm a member of members only pond I've had some nice fish out of here if I remember in the edit I'll try and put some of the it's not me posing with the fish because I'm not going to go fishing on my own so I didn't really have anyone to take the photos, but I've had some really big carp out of here. There's some nice golden tench and all sorts in here. Little, an old mill pond it used to be. I'm pretty sure where these houses are here, that's where the mill used to be. And then this was what cooled the mill and helped the mill run. So sorry about this rain, I'm gonna have to try and get under the shelter over here, go and put the scooter under there for a little bit. Have a smoke, have a bit of a drink. And then put the waterproof cover on this camera and then we'll, uh, yeah, we'll get on mooching back. Trust me to go out today. And I looked at the weather before I come out, so it's, it's not going to rain till 2pm. It is probably about, it'll probably see it on the screen if the time hasn't changed. Uh, but yes, the time will be on the screen, you'll be able to fucking see that. Yeah, let me just get over here and put the scooter out the rain. It's alright in light rain, like this type of stuff, do you know what I mean, but... Oh god that rock slicker slipper. Let's put that there. <laughs> Good job there's a shelter under here. 
Right, let me put this here. I'm going to pause the recording for a minute and then switch over to the waterproof casing. Wait for this rain to bugger off a minute. <laughs> I'll be back in a second. In a minute, these are just some Fox ones that I got from Go Outdoors, I think it was. But I ordered some off the Fox Racing website last night. The Muddy Paws, I believe you anything to take it home if there isn't associated a rubbish to go in there you know what I mean? Put that in the backpack, put that up, get the helmet on, let's go for the journey home eh? I hope the ankle's been okay stuff like that because this is the only second time of me 
I'm using this camera on the chest mount. I think it might be a little bit difficult to be able to mount it to this helmet. I'd have to get a bit of a different one. But we've only done 11 miles on this so far in total. Like I say, I've not used it that much. I've got it. My birthday is the 10th of February. I think I've got this around. Oops, wrong way. Uh, I think I've got it a week before my birthday, but I couldn't get out in it because the weather was crap. As UK, don't don't even take the mix. But yeah, the weather's been crap and stuff like that. I take my daughter to school on it and stuff like that. We're not on roads or out like that. We're just on the pavement going slow, do you know what I mean? So nobody's at danger. I'm not going fast or anything. She loves it. She has actually got an electric scooter herself. She's got a Razor 350, I believe it is, or 300. It does like nine miles an hour. The only reason she don't go on it though is because it's got rickety, like really badly rickety wheels, so in bad weather it's not too good. But when the sun comes around, we'll be taking her to the park and, oh, and stuff like that. This lock is a proper pain in the ass. When you got those though. That, yeah, I guess I didn't feel that lock. Right. Well anyway. Well let's get trucking home. I hope you've enjoyed this little ride though. Let's just hope we're safe on the way home. We should be, I can't see why not. to go, we'll let her go. We're gonna go the same way that we came here, so. Tell you what, leaning on the scooter feels amazing. We had a, quite a bit of wind, wind resistance, you know what I mean? We had a lot of wind resistance, it was only in eco mode gear 3 and you seen us easily get into 40 odd mile an hour then in the wind coming towards us like this thing has got so much power, it's unbelievable like you really don't understand how much power these things have got if you've only had one of them commuter scooters I promise you if you're thinking on buying a Name, a Solar, any of that stuff, I'd highly recommend it if you enjoy put, um, going out on your on your little commuter scooters that'd be like 15. If you want to be able to keep up with traffic and stuff, I'd highly recommend one. 
But please be safe. Please be safe. Make sure you stick to the laws as well. I know the UK is uh, not the best place right now for these type of things and the laws are a bit screw with and all that shit. But just make sure you stick to your rules and do you know what I mean? You can have some fun, but make sure you do it safely. But I am hoping that you've enjoyed this little time out. I'm sorry if there is any um, wind or the wind's a bit too much. I'm sorry about that, but there's not really much. Oh my god, Portland Central. And it is very a smooth ride, just to be fair. It might not look it on the camera, but like I can't really feel any um, bumps and shit in the road, so. And now we're pretty much where the video started, but you're gonna see me go all the way home. Whee! Because my granddad is due to come today, he's dropping some things off for Little Monster to do some crafty stuff with, because Banana saves all the boxes and all that stuff. But yeah, it's been a really, really fun ride, I've enjoyed it. A lot, a lot. Considering the weather's been a bit shit, and as you can see, the roads are soaked, and this thing has not lost traction once. I've got so much more used to the throttle control, I don't wheel spin no more. If I was in like gear three, maybe I'd uh, wheel spin more, but gear two, 30 mile an hour. Never gonna need any more than that. Never. Perfect. And the only reason why I say you don't need more than that is because or if you wanted more than that, it's just in case you need that little bit extra, that's the only reason. And as you can see, we've just travelled distance, like quite a distance, of, like I said, that's the farthest distance I've travelled. Factory's not even moved, went into gear three. It's just not moved. Well, that, that was the end of the first trip to this first YouTube video on Monster Goes Outside. And if you didn't hear in the little bit there, like I say, I'm a Twitch streamer that didn't really go outside for a very long time. I've been streaming for like three years. I had like a, a nine month break for a bit, came back, stuff like that. But yeah, we've been at it for about three and a half years, so somewhere around there anyway. And I thought, Do you know what? I got my scooter near my birthday. I like to go fishing. I like to go do camping, all that type of stuff. Why not try out and get do more of it with the family and stuff like that? Record it, document it for future stuff. It'll be fun. But if you have enjoyed anything, consider liking, subscribing, all that fun stuff. Let me know what you'd like to see, whether it's going out more on the scooter, going out fishing, going fishing on that pond that I took you to today. Whatever it may be, as long as it's something going outside, because the channel is going outside, me going outside. So, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe, stay blessed. Bye for now. Peace.